No, it, it destroys chests. If you turn it off, chests just look black. I don't open properly, and it looks really stupid. In my opinion, it just looks really bad. Looks you kind of need to do like. Uh, fair enough. Then. Oh, I just got really fed is, up with it. I got so used to like playing with the uh, smooth lighting off and all that rest, all the oh, black yeah. stuff off, that I really kind of. The like default look really endured endeared itself to me. Yeah. Fair so, yeah, I always liked it. Like old times. I prefer having it on minimal. It just adds a little bit better. It makes it a little bit darker, but it's nice. Oh yeah, and brownie mugs are amazing. Brownie mugs? You can make brownies in mugs. Awesome. I'll send you the recipe. Sounds you can like make a orgasm in a cup. It literally, well, it's not, it's not amazing, but you can make it in a microwave in about two minutes. It takes two minutes to cook, and about maybe five minutes to mix. Uh, dude, um, Mike, you should download Optifine. Yeah, maybe. It's very good, it allows you to, like... Well, first of all, I turn off the fucking rain, because it's dumb. Okay, you can't turn off rain, because it's a game for the element. <laughs> no, you can. You can turn it off in Optifine. No, that's a single player. Oh, you turn off, oh, right, the lag it causes, but it would still exist. Yeah, I was wondering. It, it still has an effect, but it doesn't, you know... Yeah, that's what I mean. Sorry, I was wondering. I was like, I turn off the rain, I was like, it's just cost them all. <laughs> if you go for particle, if you go for particles minimum, it's, uh, or reduced, it's actually a lot better. Like, it's the only problem with particle minimum, you can't actually see if the villagers are, um... If you're trained with villagers, you have to turn it on, or you, you won't understand what's going on. Really? Because when they emit particles, if the deal is, um... If they have a new deal, or if, like uh, they're updating, like they and you know when you use bone meal on um, what's the thing called again? Um, bone meal on like um, anything, right? It should it'll go green if it worked. Mm. And particles, but I suppose most of the time, like if you're frightened and if you're just like mining, you don't need it at all. Um. Oh yeah, Jamie, did you get crap set up? Or you know, it's gonna bother? No, not yet. I'm kind of busy being all leveling up and shit. You know what you could do? You always wanted to record stuff in Call of Duty. You could buy Call of Duty on the PC, get a pad, and record it there. That's cool. Yeah. One thing that it has against uh, Afterburner is it's so light. Yeah, I don't work for 64 bit programs. Uh, yeah, that's not it. I'm not sure. Okay. And I'm so. So that means I can do time lapse paintings. Last time I was running uh, MSI Afterburner 1080p, I um, caused the blue screen. Alright. So. Oh. Remember that time we were playing. Uh, Sounds like a nice story. Remember that time we were playing Saints Row? It's like all of a sudden. Oh my god, the amount of cows. There's more now, Michael. Cows. <laughs> cows. There's more cows. Oh jeez. Oh yeah, Mike, remember the way that, you know, that new Ridge Racer that looks less like Ridge Racer when it's Burnout in Dracomania? I thought from the, from the title it sounded a lot more like an A for Speed. No, oh, it's actually... You get to build tracks, right? Like you can disassemble the tracks and bring it to fits. It handles like Ridge Racer, but you get takedowns like Burnout now. Apparently, Criterion are working on a new Burnout game. Fine. Really? Yeah, they made Black and all the Burnout games, and they're fucking serious at fucking games. And then they made the last two Need for Speed games. They did? Yeah. 
made the run. No, that the was heck? that was black box, and the run was actually pretty decent. No, the problem I heard with the run was it took like like a minute and a half to to restart a level if you fucked it up. No, of not thirty, like. not thirty seconds, really. That's all I heard. Uh, but yeah, I don't really care, but. It doesn't really bother me too much that there's quick time events in between races. It kind of, funny enough, it, if they branded it as anything but Need for Speed, it would have sold like a bomb. It would have like made a killing. Yep. Isn't it? Just fucking uh, EA's marketing again. What marketing? <laughs> Long. Seriously, the decisions EA make don't actually make any sense. They were the worst company in America for the second year running this year. Really? And, you, and did you see their press statement about it? Yeah, we could do better. No. Um, recently, we've gotten a lot of emails saying protesting against uh, oh, the ability to have same sex, same uh, same sex intercourse in Mass Effect. Right. And through that's the Bioware people. Yeah, yeah. and. Basically, they said, oh yeah, we didn't do anything wrong, it was just that some people don't like us. Seriously, there is a small group of people that only play that game because they like to live out their sex fantasies. Yeah. And they're annoyed that because they, they're furries and they can't do that. <laughs> furries or homosexuals. And I was just like, sure, you should put it in. I don't really care. Like, I'm not Even it, though there's I don't no think it makes real other sense, other characters in the game, whatever. Yeah, it just... <laughs> it, it just Another thing to do, you know? Yeah, Plus, exactly. It's just like as well Minecraft. As, that, as well as that, right? It's not first though. As well as that, what fucking right do you have to tell people how to make your how to make games? Yeah, really. Like it's it's their art. Well now you could you could still tell them to like you know, chop up like and do something. Oh yeah, maybe yeah, you can give feedback. They're always looking for feedback, but at the same time that's the way they it's like that thing. You remember when that game came out? What was it? Mass Effect 3, yeah, and everybody's like, change the ending, change the ending, change the ending. And yeah. That's that's the, what they produce. You can't tell them to not do it the way they want, like. Yeah. That was ridiculous, the whole change the ending thing. Big fucking whiny babies. Mind you, I, I, would be, I would be pissed in a reaction if just there was only three choices at the end of the game, but I couldn't understand where they were coming from. It was a journey at the end. Uh, I didn't yeah. actually see the end, but uh, it sounded alright. You got to choose the color of the explosion that destroys Earth. Pretty much. Okay, I can't yeah. believe that. I think with, I think with the add-on that they released after like fan press,